Okay, random ass glitch, not bad. That's Crane's car. You should put it on flat first, in case he tries to, you know. No, it's nothing you need to concern yourself with. I don't think so, at least. Shit. Hold on. Sheriff, is there something more I can help you with? You decided you want to taste of the words? Oh, I see. Come to audition, you bitch. Ever talk to talk about snow like that? You can't just go in there. Watch me. We have a problem. Tell me who did it. Just tell me who did it. I know you know. Mr. Crane, please. She can't help. I know you know what the plan is. I won't be held accountable for this. Oh my God, Big B. We don't. Anything. I promise you, I didn't do anything. These girls, the, the, the girls, they'll back me up. I just, just have to get the stupid ring working, that's all. They can't talk because of that spell. But once this ring gets through, I'll know what's going on and this whole thing will be over. That's all. Please. I'm innocent. Completely, completely innocent. The ring won't work. Greenleaf sold you out. What? No. This will work. I assure you, it, it must. <laughs> I wouldn't did you Green Lantern activate. Come on, please tell me who killed her. My lips are sealed. So maybe he didn't do it. It was a setup the entire time. How many years? What? How many years has this been going on? Two. Too many. But I didn't kill those women, Bigby. Please, I had nothing, nothing to do with that. I just, I, it just, oh, God. We found the photos of you and Lily. I know, I know. That's, that was, I just, I just love you, Snow. I love, I love you, and, and I'm sorry I'm not Prince Charming, okay? I'm sorry I didn't cheat on you and run away to Europe. You don't love me, Crane. I know what this is. I've seen it before. It is not love. Perversion. Bigby? I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this man murdered these women? He's not, he wouldn't be brave enough not to put his hmm. stamp on the world like that. He's a disgusting coward, not a murderer. I believe Thank that. Thank you, my dear. It means so much. We've been chasing this guy. Just, why now? Because look at him. You said you found evidence of him defrauding Fabletown, of using our money for his own ambitions. That's one thing. But don't you have doubts he's a murderer? We've both known him for so long. I can't believe I'm hearing this. Did you see how he was acting when you showed up? Yes, I know how this... Why would he even come here if he wasn't covering his tracks? This fuck-up knows more than he's saying. I don't. I don't! Uh, yes, okay, he probably does. But there's a difference between being involved and being the guy who did it. Okay, but if Crane didn't kill Faith and Lily, I'm sorry, but who the hell did? Your guess is as good as mine. You know, when I saw you come back here, I thought this was over. Now I know, and I'm sorry, but if the killer's still out there, I want to know who it is. We'll find out who did it soon enough. Just trust us, Vivian. I didn't intend for any of this to get so... You've been stealing money from Fabletown for years, haven't you? Yep. Yeah. This is why we're broke. We're not gonna kill you, so quit your shivering. We're not? Damn it. Have my claws ready and everything. Rod Crane, you are under arrest for the misappropriation of Fabletown funds. You have the right to counsel, the right to depose witnesses. But as of right now, you're coming with us. Get the fuck up. Now. I guess we know who's in charge, Sheriff. Sometimes it's fuzzy. 
You think you have what it takes to run that office? You think I didn't make sacrifices? I made sacrifices. And you won't be in that chair one minute before you have to give up something you care about just so the wheels don't fall off the goddamn wagon. I did the best I could with what I had. And the town took everything it could out of me. Yeah, see, the thing of it is, we're better at this than you are. Hey, hey, hey not bad. <laughs> I like that. We're better at this than you are. <laughs> so legit. Man, this game, this, this story just keeps getting better and better. I love these choices, these options. They're just freaking amazing. Could have easily broke his nose, but where's the fun in that? Well, I guess that would have been fun. Sorry to, sorry to you guys. I wanted to see that. Stupid girls and preposterous schemes. What are you saying? What was that voice change? The dumbs, or the tweedles. Shit. Of course, Crane is going to get away. Ladies and gentlemen, shit. Look, it's recently come under our attention that you're, how shall I put this, attempting to claim what is the personal property of the crooked man. Shit's about to go down, ladies He's and gentlemen. He's about yay high, 120 odd pounds. Pissed his sheets until he was 14. Sound familiar? I haven't told him anything. Not now, not now. Shh. The grown ups are talking. What do you want? That sack of flour. Crane, dear. It's Crane. It wasn't my fault. <clears throat> Shut up. You're interfering with official Fabletown business. Back off, Snow. Step aside. Tweedledee, what's the, uh, you know, that thing the Mundies call me? Wha what? My nickname. You know what I'm talking about. Uh, that's it. Bloody, that's it. Bloody Mary, that's it. Thank you. <clears throat> and do you know why they call me that? Because some of them, they think it's funny to have their little sleepovers and go into their little bathrooms and say my name five times in the mirror. They find it less funny when I actually show up and feed their lungs to the family dog. And I do that for a hobby. Like golf, to relax. This was really the wrong day to try and pull this shit. I told you he'd never just give him up. Think she cares? Fuck it. Wait, who's in the other car? Well, I just got lit up. Y'all know I'm not going, I'm not dead, right? Bigby? You silly bastards. You done. You shot the wrong dude. Do you understand who the hell I am right now? You done shot the wrong mo father. Yep, just keep on walking. <laughs> Yo, we don't need to reload our shotguns. <laughs> what is this? We got that infinite ammo cheat going on, son. We thought shotguns needed to be reloaded? Crazy. Anger issues. Y'all like my pants? 
I like what I do with my hair. Shout out to that gun blaze that he had going on. Who do I kill first? I didn't know how it was time. Oh my. People don't care. Why the hell do you think you're shooting? Don't you know the fuck I am? <laughs> he doesn't know. He doesn't know. Want it to? <laughs> Y'all don't want it with me right now. They forgot that I was the wolf. I ain't gonna kill you, man. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Snow. I didn't kill him. Silly bitch. <laughs> you think your weapons can harm me? Oh, she got a silver bullet, don't you? But you know, I just didn't know when to end. She's got the woodsman's axe. It was her the entire time. Hmm. You know, you didn't think silver bullets would work on anything but a pure werewolf. But as it turns out, it's just what it is. No, I'm fading. I'm fading fast. All right, Wolfie. It wasn't my woodsman homie yet, though. Look, I know it sounds ridiculous, but really, guys. <laughs> Can you argue with these results? Because I know I can't. Silly bitch, again, do you think your weapons can harm me? Wait. Just take him, okay? Take Crane. Just stop, please. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Snow, uh, stay out of this. Crooked man. It's your lucky day, kid. Crooked man says it's okay with him. Hello, Ichabod. Got a stomach ache? You see... See, I had that button mashing on point, son. This game cheated me. Oh, and just between us girls? Crane ain't no killer. Yeah, we know. I mean, look at his face. Couldn't stick a pig if his life depended. Crane's probably like dead. your boyfriend here. Too pussy to ruin a Tweedle's day. <laughs> well, this is gonna be a beautiful relationship we have with you guys. Really, I mean it. I'm jazzed about it. I'll kill you next episode. I ain't even worried. In with the new. Hopefully. Long with the queen. I'm sure we'll be in touch. See you around. She should have just said ciao. That would have been like even more epic. All right. That was uh, episode three. Holy shit. Um, yeah, that, uh, went pretty quickly, escalated quickly, I should say. He's lucky to be alive, and he won't be next time if he keeps going like this. This is getting worse by the minute. We don't have time to sit around and wait for their next move. I'll get things under control. Woody? I'm not gonna tell you again. Back off, dog. This doesn't concern you. What do you want to talk about? I just wanted to. Um, 
about last night? After what they did to you, are you even gonna be able to stop them? Don't hold out on me, Jack. You've always got some angle. Not this time. I know when a mark's not worth the trouble. Do you? Hmm. Don't make me come down there to deal with you. I don't want it. You don't want it. <laughs> then again, you don't have much choice at this point, do you? Oh, I'll kill you. I mean, I could have easily took out a Tweedle, but I don't want to. Look at me, I'm like everybody else. Uh, investigate it first. Uh, me and 40 other nine, uh, yeah, 40.9 percent. Damn, look at that. We are all like the same. I should have been in the 46 percent or 46.2, 45.2, however, I think it was 45.2 that uh did that that didn't kill him. Damn it, whatever. This has been The Wolf Among Us, episode three. Uh, again, story escalated pretty quickly. Can't wait to uh, I finally get a chance to get my hands on Bloody Mary, take her out, you know. Because, I mean, I just didn't kill Tweedle because, you know, I mean, Snow. I just figured that she was going to be like, you killed him. You know, because she got mad at me for punching him uh, before. Even though I didn't punch him, but pff, what, what? I don't even know. I'm just trying to impress the lady. This is my goal in this game. But anyway, next time we come back, we will be jumping into episode four. And I will be caught up with everybody on the YouTubes. Uh, and pretty much everybody else is playing this game until they release episode 5, which is going to be sometime, sometime, I don't know. But thank you guys for watching yet again. This is Taren Talk signing out with The Wolf Among Us, episode 3. Peace out.